Australian solar technology is building a reputation as the world's best after capturing the attention of US developers. They spent almost two years searching for the top way to light up a futuristic city and they found it down under. Well, it's being built as the first smart gigabit community built from the ground up. A tour through a futuristic town calls for a ride in a Tesla. It's really super cool, right? So we're building a new town uh, from the ground up and more specifically from the internet up. Known as a connected city, the town is being wired with what's called Ultrafi Internet and Wi-Fi, supposedly the fastest in the world. Developers in Florida spent nearly two years searching for high-performance solar lighting and found it down under. Melbourne company Lead Sun will provide more than 10,000 streetlights to the world's biggest solar project over the next few years. I mean, is this the way of the future? I would say the future is here today. So if folks that are not going down the path of looking at having smart streetlights and smart off-grid solar streetlights, I think they're behind by two or three years. The technology is cheaper than electric lighting and can be controlled in real time from a smartphone all these lights that you see here, they're all interconnected to each other and in real time we can adjust the brightness of the lights, we can see whether they're on or off, how the battery is doing, how they're charging and uh, diagnose them remotely if you have to do that. It's super exciting, um, you know, we started developing this technology you know, right here in Melbourne from the ground up from 2005. Lead sunlights have been installed across hundreds of locations around Australia, but creator Matt Pollard is urging developers and governments here to take up more green community projects like Florida's. They're really trailblazing over there and I'd, I'd love to have that same sort of um, ambitious um, company uh, here in Australia, but, but maybe this will kick it off and shine a light on Australian technology for the world to see.